hepatitis delta virus is a highly pathogenic virus that, in spite of a decreasing incidence in Western Europe, remains a relevant cause of morbidity in Eastern Europe and in the Mediterranean basin. In 1978, we started identifying and following patients with HDV, and in this paper, we have reported the evolutionary course of the infection over a mean observation time of 28 years. We have investigated all patients with a hepatitis delta virus infection of at least six months duration who were consecutively admitted at Howard Hospital in Milan between 1978 and 2006. HDV infection was defined by the presence of HDV antigen in liver tissue or by the detection of serum HDV RNA. 299 patients were enrolled into the study. At entry, into the study, 104 patients had a histological or clinical diagnosis of cirrhosis. 82 further patients developed cirrhosis during follow-up, therefore, overall, by the end of the study, cirrhosis was diagnosed in 186 patients with an incidence rate of 4% per year. Independent risk factors for cirrhosis were previous treatment with interferon and corticosteroids, as well as persistent HDV replication. 54 patients experienced at least one episode of liver decompensation after a mean of 68 months from the diagnosis of cirrhosis, with an incidence rate of 2.7%. Persistent HDV replication, alcohol consumption higher than 40 grams per day, and female sex were the only independent predictors of clinical decompensation. 46 patients developed a hepatocellular carcinoma with an incidence rate of 2.8% per year. Persistent HBV replication and previous treatment with interferon and corticosteroids were independent predictors of a cancer development. Overall, 63 patients died of liver failure in more than 50% of cases at an annual rate of 1.1%, with persistent HTV replication being the only predictor associated to an increased risk of mortality. We therefore conclude that persistent HTV replication leads to cirrhosis and hepatocellular carcinoma at annual rates of 4% and 2.8% respectively, and is the only predictor of liver-related mortality.